being foolish So I'ma show you what the truth is It's all of you, it's all of you, it's all of you I'm not always there when you fall But I'm always on time you guys and welcome back to my channel so hopping right into this tutorial i am priming my eye and i'm using the urban decay naked skin concealer um as an eyeshadow base for today and then i'm going to be setting that with miss laura once i am done setting my eyes i'm hopping into the first eyeshadow and this is going to be coastal scents and i'm using oktoberfest oktoberfest and i'm basically just fluffing this right into the crease and just really building up this transition shade Going into the next shade, I'm picking up MAC and I'm using the color Red Brick and I'm also using my Wet n Wild Crease Brush and I'm just going to be placing that also into the crease as well and I'm really really going to be building on this color. This whole look is really about about building. I think these are, yeah, these are the only two shades that I use. So yeah, let's get that into the crayons. always have to have an extra blending brush on hand going in with that MAC 217 just to soften things up a bit and right now this step is optional I wind up adding Cypress Umber from the ABH Modern Renaissance palette I really didn't like it and I should have never did it but nonetheless right here I fixed my mistake I'm gonna be carving out my um lid and also a little bit of the crease so i basically went over where i put cypress umber because i felt that it messed up the look and i wasn't about to redo my eye look you know sometimes you just gonna have to fix it and then when i also cut out this crease i do not take it um all the way over my eye i just do it halfway and then i also take this NYX um, white liquid liner and then just how I carved out that crease I'm going to go over top of that with the NYX liner just to create a nice little line because I have no idea what you call this type of look but yeah I'm putting some white liner on top and then I'm going to be packing on one of the NYX um, duo chromatic um, eyeshadows or highlighters but first I'm placing on some MAC mixing medium and then I'm just gonna apply that all over my eye the NYX duo chromatic eyes it's so pretty it's like orange yellow like it's really really nice and side note I really hated that eyeliner because the eyeliner wanted cracking on me and I wasn't about to pay $20 for another eyeliner. I'm going into this NYX crystal liner and I placed that sparingly over that eye part where I placed the eyeshadow. Popping into face. My face is already prepped and primed with the black radiance and I'm putting on some foundation it's, which is the NYX um, foundation stick and the Maybelline Matte Portless. And I'm just gonna be buffing that in with a Real Techniques sponge. <laughs> concealer and tan setting that I'm going to be using the Palladio rice powder in a warm beige some bronziness I'm going back in with my NYX um, contour duo and wine and dine and I'm just hitting the regular um, suspects you know cheekbones forehead nose next 
Next, I'm going to be dusting away that setting powder with the Black Radiant Soft Focus Powder in Creamy Beige. Then I'm just taking those same transition shades that I used on my eye and just running it underneath the lower lash line. Then I'm adding on some highlighter. I'm first going in with the Ruby Kisses Bronze Glow and then I also do go over top of that and use the eyeshadow that I used on my eye on top of that as well. And don't forget I also get underneath my brow band. But yeah, that's that NYX color right there. Would never be much faster before you came round. I was ready to slow down before you came round. Because the eyeliner was cracking, I could not take pictures like that, so I decided to go over it with the crystal liner, and then I also used the face and body glitter in crystal just to hide the fact that the white eyeliner was cracking. I do not recommend that white eyeliner from NYX. And So now hopping on into the lips, I am lining my lips with the Rimmel London Cafe Oulot pencil and I basically put that all over my lips and then I'm going to be going over top of this um, lip color with the Full Throttle NYX lipstick and you guys this is going to be the completed look. Um, anything that I missed in this tutorial will also be in the description box. I really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I will see you in my next one. Felt like I could take the ocean